Ladies and gentlemen, this is Eric Smelser reporting to you from Lakeview High School in Lakeview, Oregon. Right now, it's an empty Lakeview gym, but let me give you an update on the scores tonight. Game number one, the Lakeview Honkers ladies really dominated the Brookings Harbor ladies Bruins as Lakeview beat Brookings Harbor High School 60 to 42. The key to the game was the Lakeview Honkers ladies defense. Tremendous defense. And Amelia Bruce is the point guard for the Lady Bruins. She was not able to penetrate inside. She was double teamed. And um, every possession, the Lakeview Honkers ladies had a suffocating defense on the Lady Bruins. And so that's why the game was one-sided. Now on the Brookings Harbor Bruins men's side, uh, Ethan Orman, their top player, number 33, he was out. And so was uh, Tanner Anderson, two of their top players. And so the Bruins really didn't have much offense. But credit to the Lakeview Honkers men as they won 58 to 28. A very one-sided game, especially in the second half. They just took over. And um, so two pretty big losses for both the Brookings Harbor men and the Brookings Harbor uh, ladies Bruins basketball team. I want to mention too, it took me five hours and 40 minutes to drive from Brookings, Oregon to Lakeview, Oregon. And um, you'll see uh, videos that I'll put up later about the snow that was all around me. Fortunately, they cleared the roadway off, so I was able to make this drive. And um, anyway, um, absolutely tremendous. And I haven't seen my wife for a month because she's been dealing with some personal things back home in San Francisco. I'm going home to see her for the first time in one month. It's the longest we've been away from each other since I met her in 2001. And thank God I'm so overjoyed that I'm going back to see my wife, Bertha, my wife, the love of my life. And um, it's about a six hour and 45 minute drive from Lakeview, Oregon, which is actually closer than Brookings, Oregon. Brookings is about seven hours and 45 minutes or eight minutes, or I'm sorry, eight hours away from San Francisco. So I'm gonna maybe get some dinner here and then I'm gonna take the long drive back to San Francisco, anticipating each moment that I get closer to San Francisco to be back in the arms of my loving wife. And I feel like crying because it's a very emotional time for me and um, just wanna share all my love for my wife in person later on tonight. So thanks for listening to me. God bless all of you. And remember the next um, Brookings Harbor Bruins basketball game will be this coming Wednesday against the St. Mary's Crusaders who are from Medford. The first game will start at 5.30 where the Brookings Harbor Bruin ladies will play the St. Mary's ladies at 5.30 p.m. That would be in Brookings, Oregon on their home court. And then the men will play at 7 p.m. The Brookings Harbor Bruins men will play the St. Mary's Crusaders men at 7 p.m. And remember, if you are in Brookings or near Brookings, you can listen to the game at uh, 95.3 FM Curry Radio. And you can also stream the game anywhere in the world just go to curryradio.com, K-U-R-Y radio.com, curryradio.com, K-R-U-R, K-R-U, Curry Radio. It's been a long day, <laughs> curryradio.com. Well, anyway, there you have it. So um, I'm going to take off and get some dinner and then head on back to San Francisco. Good night.